All right, hello everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Silent Hill 2. And uh, we had some performance issues in the the first episode, near the end, of course. Hopefully, uh, I think it's looking a bit smoother now. Now I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie. It's been a little while since I played it. I only had time to play about an hour before. Um, I'm gonna have to get used to. Oh god, I did not see you. You go over there. That's fine. Yeah, it's looking a lot. It's looking like it's running a, a lot better this time. Uh, still a bit of stuttering. Although I think I think I'm not the only one who's experiencing this issue. Alright, so I think they are. Are you coming back? Oh. I'll bash ya. Are you dead? Oh, there's another one walking around. Um, I'll let you carry on with your business. Now, it looks like I can go into this uh, grand marketplace. So maybe I'll try and do that. Let's see if it'll let me. No, it looks like I can't. The music in this game is so much more oppressive when you're wearing headphones. God damn. There's Cat Street, there's Woodside Apartments, which I that's a uh, it's an important area. There's a restaurant here. Doesn't look like I can go into it. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah. It's on the map, which I assume to me, that's the game being like, you can go here, but maybe it isn't. I don't know. I know. Am I close to an enemy? Ruby music. I don't know, maybe these locations will open up later. I don't know. This is all new to me. I'm sorry, I'm, uh, I know I'm spending a lot of time not talking and looking around, but I'm legitimately trying to, like, find where I can and can't go. There's a little alleyway here, too. I wonder what's down here. Hopefully nothing horrible. Bugs. Kill them. More bugs. Oh, I was, you know, I was trying to hit the can. Oh my god, I'm doing the same thing again, where I Dark Souls dodge <laughs> instead of picking an item up. It's gonna take me a little time to get used to. No, there doesn't seem to be anything, anything worthwhile over here. So I'm gonna keep going. All right, groovy, groovy music is just over here. I love groovy music. Who doesn't, man? Hello, Monday? Is that what it says? Are there bad things in this store? Yeah, there is. Looks like there's several bad things in this store, actually. Uh, is there like a bunch of horrible things here? There's two I can see. Very strong one. Oi. Please leave me alone while I'm bashing up your friend. Thank you. Ah! That was about the dolphin, dolphin dive on me. Oh no, the charge and spew. I don't like it. Yes. Can you stop bumming everywhere? Jeez. Ah. Oh. Oh, damn. I feel like these guys are a lot harder to fight now compared to uh, their older game counterparts. Like, they, they, they seem very hard to fight. I'm gonna have a sippy. Yeah, that's good enough. Alright. Got a note here. Let's read it. Which one's the Y button? <laughs> I'm playing this on Xbox controller. I'm not used to it. The janitor came in the other day, drunk and in tears. Had half a record with him. Kept yelling, we gotta fix it somehow. I was willing to do it just to shut him up. So I got, I got, I got up to get the glue from the cabinet, but then he realised he only had the one half, so he ran out. Can't do much about the record. Maybe ask around at Neely's next time you're there. Might be one of theirs. Alright. 
Got the record store note. I don't know if I should be saving these locations for when I have the uh, flashlight, because I'm probably missing a lot of important details, but... Read. Let's read it. Face the music. Find the melody of your dreams and kick up your heels. Face the music, huh? Alright. I don't know, reminds me of, uh... I have no mouth and I must scream, because there's a, uh, there's a similar... Into something in the jukebox on Goros's level. It's like a song you can play called Face the Music. I don't know. Music can bring you back to those wonderful moments you fought lost. Okay, not all of them are wonderful. A lot of great detail in these, like, little new areas. It's really cool. I like it. They've done very well. Alright, we've got... Vinyl Glue, by the looks of it. Yes. And a broken vinyl record. The long way. Okay. So now I think I've got, yeah, I've got everything I need. Oops, that's the wrong button. Let's combine. That, that, and that. The long way home, glued up vinyl record. Cool, all right, done. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Let's get the hell out of here. <sighs> now I do believe I have to go back to Neely's bar. Boom. Alright, uh, which is not too far away. Yeah, it's just down the road. God, this game looks good. Let's avoid the sexy, slimy thing. Not now, I say. Oh, this thing is... I probably don't need to be fighting these things, but I feel like I have to. I need to put them down. Um... Oh, okay. There's the Ely's again. Let's have a look. Drug. Hotline. Okay. I thought it was a, a sheet advertising drugs on the uh, telephone pole. I was like, that's a very bold advertising plan, I have to say. This game's still a little bit choppy. Like, it's either, it could either be because I'm recording, or I don't know. There was a hole here, it's gone now. Uh-oh. Alright, now we can go here. Uh, select. What am I doing? Ah, oh, but we need to, uh... Oh my god, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Key items. I, like, use it? No. Read, long way home. Okay. Obviously I need to, yeah. Inventory. Oh, shit. There we go. I just had to press the buttons in the right order. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Alright. Um, coin. Oh, I need to put the button back. Yep. And then we got a coin. E? No, sorry. C. Oh, sorry. No, I'm an idiot. So it's C2.
We spent the whole day there. Just the two of us staring at the water. Son of a bitch. Ha! It's probably a key to the apartment block. Yeah. I like how they sort of restructured everything, because, like. Yeah, I'm not gonna go into it just in case there are people here who are watching or haven't played the original game, but. All you have to know is that they, it seems like they've uh, restructured how, uh, or that they've sort of reordered how, how things happen in the story. Which is really cool. I like it. Giga computer. I don't know how much a pre-built PC from them is. Um, yeah, I'm really liking, like, how they, uh, I thought it was going to go into one of those, like, anime, like, credit sequences. <laughs> But just like they showed the quick sort of shots of uh, different locales in Silent Hill. Like it didn't even occur to me that it was like a flashback to, you know, something that they did. Oh, there's bugs somewhere. I see, you've got a lot more bugs in this game. Look at all this garbage. Alright, um. Get into the. Get into the apartment now, which is scary. I don't like it. Woodside apartments. What's up on that? Just gonna sidle my way around you just to see what's over here. Yep, more. Whoa, the music is. The music got like really sinister all of a sudden. Door that wakes in darkness, opening into nightmares. Oh, they've actually hidden it this time. That musical cue was very intense. I thought I was going into a fucking boss fight on the street or something. I was like, oh god. Alright. He was looking at something. Oh, he was too. So many people here. Photo. Interesting. Alright. And we got more photos here. Texan Cafe. We gotta leave. Meet me there. I didn't flip it. Oops, there's probably nothing on the other side anyway. Can you go away with the noises? What am I looking at? I don't know. Yuck. I go in. Yeah, Neely's barkey. No, it's not that. Okay, shit. I need to do something then. Hmm. Okay. Oh, the whacking of the thing must have gotten the attention. Oh. Oh man, oh there's another one crawling around. Oh fuck, I'm giving them what for. I gotta say the combat feels very like intense in this one though. Like it, it's cool though, I like it. Anything in these cars? Oh there is, shit. I didn't even, I didn't even see the health drink in there, I was just deciding to whack it. Um, Alright. Is there anything on the map? Okay, so there's... Okay, so that note mentioned the Texan Cafe or something. But it's been ticked off, so I feel like... I've got a bunch of notes. I need to investigate it. Let's, let's flip it. Maybe there is something on the other side. No, there isn't. Okay. And it pointed me towards this too, so I'm not sure what it was 
trying to show me just then. Like, there's a bunch of garbage and stuff in here. So I don't know... Oh, man. I, I feel really stupid right now because the thing's probably, like, really obvious. So many people here. One of these strange photos I found. An intricately wrought key found in Neely's bar. So I'm, I'm going to assume, because he thought about the park, that it's probably a key to the park or something. Personal... I got my photo of Mary, too. Let me look at it. Nothing on the back. I don't even think of looking at his items. Stupid. Um, there's a letter. My restless dreams. I see that town. So, yeah, we've heard this before. Um, South Fail. Last oh, shot message. Texan Cafe. There's a note on it. Texan Cave, we gotta leave. Meet me there. So maybe there's something at the Texan Cafe now? I don't know. I mean, there's, there's a... There's a keyhole here. Like, you, you think it would be this, but it's not. I guess I need another key from somewhere. There was nothing over on this side, right? I'm thinking maybe I missed something. There might have been something on this body over here. Ah, oh yeah, there's a note. Hold on. Idiot. Didn't see it. What are they? I shouldn't go through. I don't know why. I won't. They don't stink, but it feels like they do. No smell at all. Huh. Oh, fuck off. I think he might be dead. Um. I don't realize how intense his breathing was either. You can hear him breathing, like, really heavily. He's like... <sighs> Like, okay, so uh, my only lead here is to go to the Texan Cafe. So I guess I'm going to go to the Texan Cafe. Unless there's something on the side here that I'm not aware of. There is a white shroud here, but it doesn't seem like you can climb over. It, says, it seems like shrouds uh, dictate where you can, like, hop over and stuff, but... I can't seem to... He, he doesn't, he's not looking at anything either. Here to corner. Do we need to go this way? No? Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I'll go to the Texan cafe, I guess, because it's not it's not super far. I'm sure there's people yelling at me, being like, you're an idiot. The key is like right there. I can't find it. Uh, all I'm going off here is a note outside that says meet me at the Texan cafe so I'm gonna meet whoever this is at the Texan cafe which I'm I'm sure there'll be no one but you know I think I've been into that dry cleaner before I'm just trying to see where the uh I don't want to run too far but it seems like I can't because there's a big barrier there yep there it is all right we're at the Texan cafe so did I miss a key in here or something? There's a coat. Maybe that might have a key in it. No. Really friggin' dark in here. It doesn't appear to be anything here. Okay. Let's check other places we haven't been. I was trying to think of other places we haven't been yet. We've been up that alley. There's a safe spot up there. Did I go up to that bit over there? Oh man. Am I going to have to walk, look up a walkthrough within the first two hours of the new Silent Hill? Am I that stupid? So, I really don't want to be wandering around for like the whole game for like a good chunk of time looking for this goddamn key. I'm trying to remember if I walked up there. I feel like I would have. I'm sorry, I keep checking the map. It must be so annoying. <laughs> I just want to make sure I'm walking. Oh, oh, hello. Yeah, there was a dead body here. I got whatever was there. Was there anything over here though? 
Don't feel you. Oh, hello. Blood. What does that mean? Did I? I actually can't remember if I've been here already. I think I have. Yeah, I have. 100% I have. This is where I came from. Okay. Um. Oh, man. Alright. I'm gonna quickly look up where to find the key, because I'm actually kind of lost, and I don't want to waste any more time, so... I'll see you after a quick jump cut. Okay, I'm back. So... I am an idiot. <laughs> um, yeah. So... There was something else in Neely's bar that I forgot. I forgot that there was a locked door. So yes, I'll need to go back to Neely's bar. Oh, the frame rate's dropping again. God dang. Um... Why you do this, Silent Hill? Okay, now it's okay. Um, yeah, yes, there's the, the, the key goes to Neely's bar. So I, I went walking around like an idiot for like way too long. Trying to, because uh, I, I just assumed it was the key to the apartment or the, the Rosewater Park or something, but it's not. Oh yeah, I forgot there's a fucking door right here. I haven't played this game in a little while, so I totally forgot there was a locked door in here. Well, that makes sense, doesn't it? Um, Alright, let's explore. I like how this, everything's barred up around here. It's very uninviting. Guess that's the point, isn't it? I know what, 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 what to do here. What is the point of these little <sighs> shitty windows? Oh, hello. Give me that health drink. Alright. We got some more goodies around here. Hello? Got a note. Let's read it. He came back after you left. It's fine. He didn't try anything. He just seemed sad. Mumbled something about getting out of town with someone. I wasn't going to let him drive in his condition, so I locked him out. His car should be out back. Maybe check if it's still there by morning. It's the greenish blue one. Plate number ending with 6, I think. Or 06. Alright, so I'm looking for a car. Wait, what? We wrote? We got like a pen out or something. That was weird. Um, out back, eh? Hey, we're out back now. Cool. So I also learned of some other new mechanic that they've... Put in the game called uh, Mem Memories of the Past or something. So I think what, that's what those little. When I found that pile of blood, uh, and there was that little sort of shot of James looking at it, and like the little musical cue. That's what that was. That's why I was like, so there must be like references to the original game or something. That's anything I can think of. I didn't really read too much into it because I didn't want to spoil everything for myself, but... Yeah, it was interesting. So I've got to keep an eye out for some stuff because it seems like there's uh, collectibles and whatnot. Oh, bugs. Greenish-blue car and it ends in 06. Smash. That's 2-0. I mean, I'm going to check all the cars anyway, because they seem to have goodies in them. Sometimes. Um, your brown car. That's a poo car right there. It's a Ghostbusters car. Got a big gate. Where am I on the map? I'm over here. Okay. Smash up some windows. Let's vandalize. I don't know. I'm assuming you can you can see the items through the window. Boxes. There's another thing there. Oh, that's a can. Fucking hell, man. 06. You all got any health drinks? 
that. Okay. Um, is that where I came from? Oh my god, I'm so bad at, like... That's not where I came from. This is different. I'm so bad at, like, keeping track of where I am in this game. Alright. I guess I've got to go through that. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. He was looking at something just there. Yes. I don't think... I didn't smash those windows. Unless I'm... My brain is just flat out dying right now. 06. I mean, that kind of fits the bill. It's like a bluish. It's a blue car. I guess it's, I guess it's not green. There's something on the floor here. Or oh, maybe that is the car. Because that looks like a key to me. Ew. What the fuck? Alright, I've got no time to read. Holy shit. I'm gonna have to go. I'm leaving. Whoa! It's a fucking windstorm now. Well, I'm back out on the street. Tornado blowing through town. It's dropping the frame rate. <laughs> ah, fuck it. Oh my god, this town is so very uh, threatening all of a sudden. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Oh, I need to go to the Woodside Apartments. Alright. I'm running. I don't know, there's some other stuff I can do, but I'm, I'm assuming I can do this stuff whenever I feel like it. Let me in! There you go, we're finally in here. Whew, that was, uh, that was an ordeal, wasn't it? All right, with the map. Oh, I like it. It has a marker for Rosewater Park. Interesting. Well, this is looking nice and this is very inv inviting and cozy compared to outside. Tell you what, um, let's have a quick look around here. Eh? It's a TV. I've been covered in a shroud. That's always nice. Ah, it's the coin puzzle. Cool. Well, I don't have any coins yet, so we can't do it. Three bright coins and five holes B. First sits the maiden underneath the tree. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> oh, jeez come out of nowhere the wind from behind the maid of the maiden doth blow a beautiful flower alone has to grow and here comes the man so sleek and so fine in the pale moonlight his eyes doth shine all right sorry for dying in the middle of that sentence there yeah, i don't know what happened okay well, i'm gonna save the game i guess cool save screen i like it all right Let's go. Can I even go outside now that I've committed to being in here? Am I not allowed? Nah, I'm not allowed now. <laughs> I'm committed. Alright, well, let's explore then, I guess. Can't go in here. I think I already tried that door. Holy fuck, it's dark. Can't go outside. Oh, there's a health drink in here. It'll be sneaky, I could actually see that, but the little, like, circle wasn't coming up. So I kind of assumed there was nothing there. I can hear enemies. No items. I don't want another key. Can't use that. There's a toilet. Am I going to have to put my arm in it? No. Gun. 
Penguin, 10 cartridges. Two bullets. Well, all right then. Um, all right, so... Where the hell am I going? Ah, scared myself. Do I have to jump through a window or something? Ah, oh, there's a cupboard here. I should have checked that before I did anything. Handgun ammo. There's more handgun ammo. Okay. Back here again. We don't, unless, uh, do we have the... Is, are the coins like already in there? No. Yeah, I don't have, I don't have any coins. I can't do it. Can I go anywhere else? Am I missing something? I feel like I'm missing something. Can I go here? No. Yeah, oh yeah, it's stairs. Fucking moron. Oh, that's a lovely Hello? noise. Is anyone there? I wouldn't be calling out to fucking anyone in this apartment. Not now, not ever. It's like, how about we stay quiet, huh? Nothing in there. Please, stop with the noises. Light in this room. Oh no, mannequins. Oh, flashlight. Yeah, I didn't even think of that. A pretty looking room. What's in here? Anything? Let me just rifle through your drawers. I've got a lot of health drinks right now. Feeling pretty good. They're probably going to lose them all real soon. Uh. Oh, fuck you. Oh, he's fucking dead. Yeah, they give me a bunch of health drinks because these things are going to give me some, uh, trouble, I think. Let's drink. Oh, I'm glad to have a flashlight. Oh, we've got a key. Shoot. Alright. Well, if I had a gun, I could shoot. These clothes. They remind me of someone. Yeah, it's weird. Like, there's certain things that make the frame just rate go shit itself, but when I go onto this, it's. The frame rate goes back to normal. I don't know. Open the map up. No. Certain, yeah, see, and then that sort of kicks it back to the frames being smooth again. I, I don't know. It's, it's probably an option I've enabled. Probably one of the graphics options. Oh, and that locks itself. I know it doesn't. I'm just spooking myself for no good reason. The door closes, though. That's kind of weird. Why oh, that? That don't work. Alright. Let's find out where this shoot key goes. I'm th this now, now we're cooking with the flashlight here. I assume this won't work, no. So that means I either have to go down or up. My my guess is I'll probably have to go up. There's no key there. I I like you can see like the little circle from the flashlight too. It's very nice attention to detail. There we go. Shoot courtyard. Let's go here first, I suppose. Let's go to the scary looking courtyard. Oh god, fuck this place. <laughs> Not allowed. That hallway was just all encompassing darkness. Garbage shoot out of order. Please do not use until the problem is resolved. Yeah, we know you know we're gonna be using that garbage shoot. You just know it. I don't know if I should have uh, explored the third floor, or I might not have even been able to go up there, but I'm gonna be, looks like I'm gonna be able to uh, progress through uh, moving that thing to the window. So let's do it. Let's go. Oh. We're in. 
And I'm already getting radio static. That's always good. Locaine siblings murder. Perpetrator commits suicide in custody. Walter Sullivan, the culprit in a recent homicide case, was found dead after taking his own life on the morning of the 22nd in his jail cell. According to the police statement, Sullivan's death was caused by blood loss resulting from severing his carotid artery with a soup spoon buried two inches in his neck. Sullivan was apprehended on the 18th of this month of, on account of brutally murdering Billy and Miriam Locaine. Even though Walter Sullivan did not strike a former schoolmate from his hometown of Pleasant River as someone capable of murdering children, the schoolmate admits to having witnessed Sullivan in a state of severe paranoia shortly before his arrest. He was blurting out all sorts of strange stuff like, He's trying to kill me! He's trying to punish me! The monster! The Red Devil! Forgive me, I did it, but it wasn't me, he recounts. I guess now that I think of it, he was kind of crazy, the schoolmate concludes. Yeah, it's kind of bizarre that Walter Sullivan is mentioned in this game. I mean, I, I know he... Most likely what happened was for, for the room, they just thought like, Oh, well, we already got an established character, Walter Sullivan. So why not, uh, oh god, this fucking bed is in a bad way. So why not just use an existing character, you know? And, you know, of course, everyone knows that the, uh, the, the, the twin monster, or whatever it's called, the, the one that points at you, and it's got, like, the two big baby heads that's based off of Billy and Miriam Locaine from the room, so... It just makes the enemy even scarier. Like, it's already bad enough. There's horrible things in here somewhere. Uh, I don't like it. Bugs. Oh, it was a bug. All that one, all that radio static for one shitty bug. Come on, man. Alright, new room. I'm keeping an eye out. There's a fucking mannequin! You son of a bitch! I will kill you. Ooh, these things fucking... Ooh, these things got hands. Oh, no, they don't. They got lots of legs. But far out, man. These things, they, they hurt. Oh, I use a syringe, I guess. Yeah, I think I did take quite a few hits in that exchange. So, I mean, that was a pretty good use. Getting plenty of handgun ammo. Just good. Gonna need that so I don't have to deal with the stupid mannequins anymore. Not the hard way, anyway. This apartment's giving me the heebie jeebies. Um, let me look at your drawers. Nothing in here. Alright. Guess I came in here for that handgun ammo. Alright, down the hallway. Let's go. So I'm walking... Normally I'd be running through these hallways, but I, I, I'm gonna get clocked by a mannequin if I rush around. I just know it. So I don't wanna... I don't wanna go too fast. I kinda wanna pay attention. Hello. I know what's gonna happen here. Yep, we all saw that coming. Yeah, what is a kid doing here? There's no place for a child. Oh, that had the key in it already, okay. Um, Alright, so now... Now, now, now I have to go up... To the third floor. It's directing me to the third floor. Oh god. Interesting. You can hear her running around in the in the vents. Um, yeah, well, I think they'll do it for an episode. I'm gonna end it here. I don't want all these episodes to be an hour long. I wanted the first one to be an hour long, but who knows how long I'll be wandering around before there's another save point. So, uh, yeah, we're finally in the apartments. I think that there was still some stuff I need to do on the street. Hopefully, even though. 
There's, uh, there's another fucking thing wandering around? Where? Anyway, hopefully uh, when I get back onto the streets after I'm done with the Woodside Apartments, they'll let me... Uh, They'll let me do all the side quests and stuff again because there, there was there was apparently a bunch of stores I could have gone into that aren't marked on the map. I thought it was just stuff that was on the map, but obviously I was wrong. So yeah, we've still got we've got plenty of stuff to look at. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, maybe ring the bell. So you, when I release new Silent Hill 2 videos or Fear and Hunger videos, you, you'll see them straight away and you can watch them. And I'd really appreciate that. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers.